Here's a trick I've had for a long time. It's another one of my Tinion magic tricks. And it's going to kind of introduce us into a, another realm of the magic here. But this is called the Pear Box. First time I saw this illusion was, oh, I bet I was like 11 or 12 years old. It was on this talk show called Johnny Carson's. The magician came out and did this trick. And I thought, wow, that's so cool. So here's what he shows. He has this little red box here. All right. He takes the red box and he shows inside the red box he has a black box. All right. Inside the black box is a red magic ball. All right. Now, if he takes the red magic ball and puts it inside the outer box, the red box, and closes it up, it now shrinks down to fit inside the black box, which was the smaller box that was inside the red box. You've got to keep up with me on this. This gets confusing. Okay. That's impressive. But I'm wondering... Would this trick work without the red ball? Maybe. So, we take out the black box. We'll take the black box apart, open up, and get the red box out. Keep it up, don't let me lose you. Okay. And inside the red box, of course, we have the red ball. Now, what we want to do is we're going to see if this trick still works without this magic red ball. So, we're going to put the magic red ball right over here. All right. Now, we're going to close up the black box and stick it back inside the red box. Now the red box is back on the outside. The black box is back on the inside. With no magic ball creating the trick. You know, I don't know how the ball was doing the trick anyway, but the guy that sold it to me said it has to work with a sponge ball inside the box or it doesn't work. And I'm just now showing you that it does work, right? So, we take out the black box. Well, look at there. Another sponge ball. <laughs> That's why it worked, because we had the sponge ball inside. So this time we'll put the red box inside the black box. There we go. No sponge balls inside either box. Because I got them both. I don't know where, where in the world did you come from. But anyways, we got this one here. So now, as I'm going to show you, and so, if you don't need it, oh, well, look, another magic ball. All right, all right, all right. That's just ridiculous. Well, my mom always said, you always put your toys up when you're done, right? So, let's put the, I like the yellow ball in the red box. And we'll take the blue ball and we'll stick it in the black box. And we'll take the red ball. Well, we can't put the red ball in either box for the pure fact that it's just too big. <laughs> That's called a pair of box. 